Hello, welcome back again. So today we're gonna continue our Laravel series and we're gonna focus right now on the installation which is an easy one. So let's go ahead and get started. So today I'm gonna teach you how to create your first Laravel project. So when creating a Laravel project, there are two ways in installing it. So the first one is using Docker and the second one is using Composer. But today we're gonna using composer so let's go ahead and open up our browser and type composer download and here you can find a result but let's get to the getcomposer.org so the first one so let's go ahead and click that one so this is the composer homepage so composer is a dependency manager for php so let's click the download button and here i am using my mac so if you are using windows uh, i think there is an exe file for each and after we install that one let's go ahead to our terminal and check if composer is really installed by typing composer dash dash v so i think we're ready to go now so composer is installed so i'm gonna change directory to my uh, development folder so you can make anywhere you want so in my case i will make mine under development and tutorials so let's go ahead and type that one so after it let's type composer create project laravel slash laravel space your application name so hit enter and let's wait for it to install so it shouldn't uh, take a while let's wait to install and here it is right now so let's open it up using our favorite code editor for me i'm using vs code so let's hit that one there you go and enter it should open up so here as you can see uh, we have already files here so this is the default laravel structure so let's talk about that one later so right now uh, let's run the laravel so let's open up a terminal inside vs code and let's type php artisan term so hit enter so this should open up the development url so let's click that one and boom there you go so this is our first laravel project running in a web browser so i hope you guys make it uh, find it easy so on the next video we're gonna talk about the structure of the laravel thank you so much guys and don't forget to subscribe